But first, we want to touch on that weather threat that is facing tens of millions of Americans across the country. In Colorado, the biggest January snowstorm in more than three decades. It dropped a foot of snow in the Denver area. Interstate 70 was shut down in both directions after a multi-vehicle pileup. And in the south, there are reports of a tornado in southern Arkansas, four states on alert tonight, with tornado watches in effect. So for the very latest, let's bring in meteorologist Mike Bettis from our partners at the Weather Channel. Good evening, Mike. Nora, good evening. Some severe storms like we saw produce damage in Arkansas could push their way into Tennessee and Mississippi through the rest of the evening, watching for strong winds and potential tornado touchdowns as well. That area highlighted in red most likely to see the storm, but here's the good news. That storm line looks to weaken as it pushes through Georgia and the Carolinas early tomorrow and through the day on Thursday. However, severe weather could rear its ugly head across the Ohio River Valley here, including places like Columbus, Cleveland, Detroit, and Pittsburgh. That storm then pushes across the Northeast through the rest of the day tomorrow. The snow is there from the upper Midwest over into the Northeast where as much as five to eight more inches is in the forecast here. Then we watch for the next one that comes in toward the weekend and beyond as that low tracks along I-70 and eventually into the Northeast. Nora still looking for our first measurable snow of the season here in places like New York as well as Philadelphia. Could this be the one to do it? All right. Sounds like snow's on the way. Mike Bettis, thank you.